it was great political risk for you yes. to to negotiate with Democrats on health care. Um, but at the end of the day, you uh, you voted against it. Right. You criticized the Democrats for what you called ram and jam. Right. Um, talk about that. And then I also want to hear what your main concerns about the health care reform bill that passed uh, would be. Right. Um, you know, if you look back in history, whether it's Social Security or Medicare or civil rights, um, you know, they would not have been woven in the fabric if our country's only yielded one vote margin strategy by passing by one vote. There is this tendency now, and it happens on both sides, even we in the majority, is just, you know, to get one vote to get over the finish line. In this case, and generally in the Senate, it's the 60 vote, you know, to overcome, a, you know, a filibuster. Uh, so that's the regrettable part. So there isn't this incentive or inclination to incorporate ideas. The problem I had with the health care bill, for example, is that I had a list of problems with, uh, with the bill. And it really uh, became a much bigger piece of legislation once it passed the Finance Committee. And I voted for it in the Finance Committee, uh, saying that we had to do a whole lot more. But I thought it was important to continue the process. And I said the credibility of the process will determine the credibility of the outcome. So we needed a number of changes and to build a broader support. But unfortunately, it went off into a different direction with $210 billion in Medicare payroll taxes that could you know, adversely affect small businesses, for example. There are $500 billion overall uh, in taxes. And we didn't know whether or not it was going to actually yield affordable plans. I mean, that remains to be seen. It's a big question. Uh, premiums are going up over the next few years. The grandfather clause that they said, well, you can keep the insurance that you, uh, you have. Not exactly. I mean, the, the regulations that have been uh, produced as a result of that provision of allowing you to keep your plan is 121 pages. And so I understand that many of the plans, in fact, maybe 80 percent in one major insurance company will not be grandfathered because of changes. So there were a lot of questions that needed to be sorted through uh, in the process and a number of issues that I wanted incorporated that didn't become part of the package. I had asked for an analysis state by state to see what were the costs, what in the bill would drive up the costs of health care and what would contribute to uh, bringing down the costs. Um, and I was never able to get that from the Congressional Budget Office, uh, that analysis, which I thought was crucial and central uh, to making a decision.